Hey, Coach Abel here, the Able Body Experts, doing a Coach Em Up on what I call trainer bias. And too often people get um, focused in so much on a certain goal that they don't see the, the benefits of training in other ways to accomplish that goal. So they don't see the payoff of doing programs that are outside of their comfort zone when that is actually what is called for. And to make a very general point on this, so I can keep it short, is a lot of the times what I notice is females are hesitant to do strength training protocols yet they say they want to be uh, leaner and more athletic looking and males are hesitant to do conditioning protocols um, because they think they want to build muscle and they, and they have the same goal so oftentimes these things are, are contraindicated whereas the female instead of doing more metabolic work should be doing more strength work and the male instead of doing more traditional bodybuilding work creating all that neural confusion should actually be engaging in a little more hybrid approach with a conditioning focus so there's a lot of ways to think outside the comfort zone if you've been following my YouTube clips then you know we do a lot of that stuff but again it all boils down to who is the trainee and what is their specific needs state and I talk about needs state a lot in my book the able approach um, if you want to know more about it it addresses what the clients need state is if you want to find out uh, more about that for yourself as a trainee or maybe you're a trainer training other people I recommend you get the able approach but again there's a there's a real pervasive trainer bias out there that has to do with people training in their comfort zones based on a specific goal whereas what they need to do is get away from that comfort zone even if just for a little while to uh, get the body responding in a different way this has been a coach em up on trainer bias and a client's needs state